Well, hey everybody, welcome to Busted. I'm Sal. I'm Ethan. And I'm Ben. Today we're talking about Batman Black and White, the Joker statue by Greg Capullo. This is the new 52 faceless Joker version. We went with classic Joker last episode. I thought we'd go with new 52 Joker this time. Initial thoughts about this statue of the Joker? Well, I don't like it. No, you don't like it? No, do you not like the statue? Or you not like the idea? Or do you not like his face? <laughs> no, or the fact that he barely has one. Um, I, I'm not a huge fan of the concept, and now I'm looking at the statue, and I don't like, like, some of the weird paint details on his arm. It makes it look angular mm -hmm. and... Yeah. Rough. Now it is made in the in the stylings of artist Greg Capullo, who's doing the Scott Snyder uh, Batman book right now. This is ripped almost directly from the page from Death of the Family. He's, like, drawn like that. he's drawn exactly like this. Uh, it's a little bit more detailed in the face, actually. Yeah, I was gonna it's say a there's lot, a lot of detail. There's a lot face. of detail. Actually, it's overwrought with detail. Yeah. I'd say. There's just too many, la lines, too many lines in his face. Yeah. I don't. Yeah. I don't know what I'm even it's looking too busy. at. It's very busy. Too That's busy. exactly yeah. right. Now that said, there's a lot of things that I do like. I love all the accessories. That oh, you yeah. obviously can't take these, out. Of play these with. tools, so cool. Yeah, they look like tools. They're yeah. great. Um, and they got splatter on them. Yep, because he's hammering someone's face in, I guess, or something. Yeah, he's hitting Alfred in the head. Oh, uh, it looks great as far as the details. I think go. There are a couple of issues that I have. Uh, some of the, the the lines over where they where they attached pieces mm -hmm. look like that's where they attach the pieces. Mm -hmm. um, I think the victories really lie in the paint job. Yeah, I think. I think I love the overall look of this character. It's demented. Mm -hmm. It's terrifying. Like, it's actually unsettling to look at. Yeah. Which is clearly what they were going for. Um, I like the black and white effect. I think that makes it even more creepy. Definitely. I would not put this on my LinkedIn. Ah, uh, yeah. For that reason. Uh, I would It's just too much. One. It's too, for people who are not into that. If I was a, like, collector of, like, horror stuff, I was, mm -hmm. like, this would go great in Rob Zombie's house. <laughs> I like the overall pose. I love the paint job. I like the details. The details are really, really strong in this piece. Yeah. That said, I want this in my living room. <laughs> so we're unanimous there. Oh, yeah. I think, though, this is a great piece for someone. If you look at this and you're like, that looks fucking cool. I want that. I guarantee you want it. Oh, totally. Because it's it's super high quality. Yep. Great paint job. It's not precarious. It's not going to fall over. It's also not very light. Uh, mm -hmm. there's, enough, there's enough weight on this thing to stay where it right. would go. Right. Should I test it? Should I just knock no. it? No. <laughs> Because the, the, the grounding it's on is not, not stable, good. but you'll notice Joker remains perfectly... Yeah, uh, he has no problem with this shaky... <laughs> yep. Earthquake test! No, I'm just kidding. Yeah. Despite his actually very uh, awkward feeding... Yeah, yeah. they actually feeding. balanced it quite God well, because he's, he's leaning backward, but they tilted him forward to start, so he actually makes like a perfect arc, so his head is actually directly over his feet. Yeah. So he, it's actually balanced quite well. It's a good bit of engineering. And there. unlike most of the pieces we have, I can't take him... Off mm. the base, so which is probably good for stability. Right? Yes, it's not great if I want to take the base off and have Greg Capullo sign it, which is what yes. a lot of collectors will uh, do. Um, but yeah, it's hard to get your hand in there. Now you also said that this was not a limited run. No, it doesn't seem like it is. I've tried to find different like what what it, what number it came in, but it doesn't look like that's the case. It looks like it's just a solid which, run, which suggests to me they think these things are just going to fly off the shelves, right? So they don't even need to like, like, everyone wants build the artificial Joker. demand. I, by I can it. guarantee you, it doesn't. Yeah, I wouldn't think so. This is an actual. This is a splatter effect. Someone did like a. Yep. With that, which they means totally did. The these are probably the like. There's no way blood splatter got back there. Well, maybe he used them on other people. The, yeah. splat the splatters from previous. Yeah, games. or he was doing this as he was killing people, so different parts of him were facing the splatter. Yeah. If you bought another one of these, I bet the splatter might be different. That'd be cool. Depending on how they put it on there. Yeah. I mean, maybe there's a way to precision put splatter on, but mm, I doubt it. Maybe I bet there's just a machine that goes like. Pss, pss, Right, and they all have to get approved. Yeah, yeah. blood like, splatter approved. Oh, blood yeah. splatter approved. Oh no, this one's a little bit too much. Yeah, I, I don't. I don't. I wouldn't. I don't believe it. So How much yeah. does this go for? This goes for anywhere between a hundred and hundred and twenty bucks. Whoa. Oh wow! Yeah. Really? I know. I know. Wow. There's not a whole lot there. I have a feeling. There's a lot little, here. I think. There's a lot of you detail. You don't want it, but I think there's a lot on there. For I mean, there's a whole lot of physical statue yeah. that's not there. Like really, this thing is not hefty. No, but it does oh. have a good weight to it. I, I, yeah. I it's, it's, no, like it's, for the amount of material, I think it's the right weight. Yeah, it's made it's from porcelain. Thin, he's thin. He's not thick. His arms are, you know, he's a, he's there's he's not an a lot of like, meat there. Yeah. on him. Um, so I think the weight is appropriate to the size of the statue. So uh, I want to thank you all for watching. But hey, before we go, I think we've got some pictures to show you guys oh. of your collections, everybody, using the hashtag #LHBusted everywhere where hashtags are collected. Let's check on these awesome collections. Go. Keep it up. If you submitted before, keep submitting your collections. If you haven't submitted yet, 
What the hell is wrong with you? <laughs> Look, I'll, I'll send a picture this week. Yeah. I'll just send it. And it's off of my desk. Like, just got shit out. I'm going to yeah. send a picture of shit on my desk. It's LH not going to make it in the episode. Yeah. Here's my uh, desk, LH Busted. Beat Ben's desk. Here's my cat, LH Busted. <laughs> if you see Ben's desk in next episode of hashtag LH Busted, uh, it means, no one beat means, you it failed. means that you failed us. <laughs> so please, submit oh, your God, collections please. using the hashtag LH Busted. <laughs> beat Ben's desk. In fact, don't even use the LH Busted this week. Yeah. Use hashtag beat desk and LH Busted. I'll use that too. Yeah, put both in. Just yeah. be safe. Yeah. Just in case. I don't want to lose it. But yeah, beat Ben's desk this week. That's your challenge. It's your homework. <laughs> Thanks a lot for watching Busted, everybody. I'm Sal. I'm and I'm Ben. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Goodbye.